Hey guys, back here with Tua. Gonna try and do another uh, training video here. So we've done lay down, we've done heel or walk on a leash. Hey, don't. We've done sits and stays. Might be all that we've done so far. Um, and he's catching on to all of them really good. Uh, and then I was thinking, what else can we try and throw at him that we haven't done yet? And the next thing that I could think of was shake. So I have not tried that with him at all yet. Um, so this will be the first time ever attempting it. And I decided to just do it on camera and see how he does. So I'm expecting that it's not going to go very well, like everything right away. But this will show you guys kind of what to expect the very first time you're trying to do something new with your puppy. It's not going to be perfect and it just takes consistency. Hey, no, no. He's pretty wild right now. He just got done with work for the day, so he hasn't really had a chance to play or anything. So I'm expecting this not to go very well, but that's okay because it doesn't go perfect all the time. So Tua, let's go ahead and try this. So I have my treats again, like we always do. Puppies are very food motivated, so you're always gonna want treats. I'm gonna go ahead and just give him one so that he knows we got him. Good boy. And for shake, we're just simply gonna have him sit like he is, and we're gonna tell him to a shake. Grab his hand, give him a treat. Good boy. Good boy. Pretty easy, guys, not much to this. To a sit, good boy. To a sit, good boy. To a shake. Good boy. Good boy. Good buddy. Try again. To a shake. Good boy. And just lots of praise. And like I said, since it's his first time, he's He's probably not even really going to know what's going on, but it's just about being consistent. He'll eventually catch on to a shake. Good boy. I'm not really even expecting him to uh, lift his paw up at all this time. Probably the second or third time that I try this, I'm, I'm guessing he will. Um, the second or third time of actually, you know, spending five or ten minutes on it. To a shake. Good boy. The key with training these young pups though is just being consistent. He's just 12 weeks old barely. To a shake. Shake. Good boy. Eventually it's going to click in his head that I got to lift my paw up when I hear the word shake. And we'll just do this for 5 or 10 minutes every other day until it clicks. To a shake. Shake. Good boy. Um, so far with this training, the one command that I know he knows for sure on command, no matter what, is sit, sit, good boy, sit, shake, good boy. I guess I would consider he knows heel. He walks on a leash very good. Um, he doesn't stay completely all the time for stay, but he's very good at it. Um, and lay down, we haven't practiced a whole lot practicing more and he's, he's starting to pick up on that one to a shake. Good boy. So as you can see he hasn't lifted up that paw yet. I'm not expecting that he will this training session. To a shake. Good boy. But these last few times that I'm going to try it I'm going to give him a little bit longer give him more of an opportunity to lift that paw up get him thinking a little bit. To a shake. To shake. He lifted up the paw with the wrong paw. We want to do the right paw. But that was, I think it's kind of starting to click already. Sit, shake. Good boy. Good boy. To a shake. Shake. And another thing to think about is. You can always do these before meal times when they're very hungry. He's already eaten, but he's a pig, so he always likes to eat, so it doesn't really matter. To a shake. Shake. Good boy. 
But if you have a dog that doesn't have the appetite that he has, it wouldn't hurt to wait until to do it right before mealtime so they're really hungry and they'll be really motivated to get that food. To him. To him. Shake. Shake. Good boy. So I just have two pieces of treat left, so we'll try this two more times and we'll call it quits. And we got one paw left out of them. It could have been coincidence, and it was the wrong paw. To a, to a, sit, sit, shake, no, shake, shake, good boy. To a shake, good boy. So as you can see, we we didn't get them to to do it this time, but it's the very first time I've ever tried it with them, and I wanted to show you guys what it's like to do something for the very first time. You're not going to get them to do it right away. Some of the other videos that I've done with training, I've already worked on stuff with them, so it, he was already doing it for the most part really good. And uh, I just don't want anybody to get discouraged if you see him, who's not even very good at stuff yet, or another dog that does stuff like on real. Just wanted to show you what it's like the very first time. It, it takes a while to pick up on. Um, but you'll see how he progresses with shape now over the coming weeks and months because I'll do another video. But uh, now I have it documented what it was like his first time trying. And it wasn't very successful, but it never is the first time. So a good learning experience for everybody. To him. And he needs to go run around because he's a wild man right now. Right, buddy? Thanks for watching, guys.